Uh, so welcome back guys my name is Amlan and in today's make watch me campaign we go about looking at how we can book uber right in advance now first things first i would like to say that i have actually downloaded the latest uber app so it's not like i am using an old version of uber or something so you can see i don't have like the install option so this is actually the latest version that is running on my phone right now so let's go ahead and like check out things why am i saying all this is because uh, last time when I made this tutorial, a few people said that, well, this things appear on your phone, it doesn't come on mine. So, okay. So, I log in so that I can show you exact steps right from the start. So, uh, once I put in my mobile number, there's a OTP which is automatically set and it's come here. So, after that, what do I need to do? Like, how do I book a ride in advance? So first things first, so if you're not familiar, this is basically the user interface for the Uber cab booking app. Here, you need to click on where to and it will bring the form and to picker. Form is basically where you want to have the right form. So say I want to have the right picked up for my home and say I want to have it picked up till say a certain place and say this is, uh, yeah, Forum Sujana Mall. Now, once I do that, please, please, please note, I will have this thing there and this is nothing but a schedule picker. So I will just kind of, you know, zoom this so you can see this part. You can see there's a clock attached to the car, which means that you are booking this Uber right in advance and you have to now click on it for opening up the picker. Right. So let's do. I heard someone saying wrong. <laughs> So schedule a trip brings up the calendar picker uh, and in this basically you get to select the dates. So today basically is the 29th. So I don't want to book it for today. So I say I want to have it on 31st and this is basically the date, but obviously I need to put in the time as well. So you see, this is basically the time picker and the outer side is the minute picker. The inner clock is the hour picker. So say I want to do it at um, 6.30. So sorry, the outer side is basically the R and now I come to the minute. So 6.30 in the evening. So again, I can cancel this again. I will just show it to you. So I will again do this. So I will just go here and say I want to do it at um, 10 a.m. in the morning. So and then I basically do the minute. So you can see like it gets added. Say it's not on 31st. Say I want to do it on the 2nd of Jan. So I click on the 2nd of Jan and say I want to do it in 7.30 in the morning. So I again take it. So the first hand is basically I have to come here first. So this is the hour hand 7 and then the minute. So 7.30 in the morning. So there you go. So I have now booked an Uber ride for 7.30 in the morning. And if you know how uber works you don't really get an otp or something so you will get the driver details you can go to the pickup point and that's it so i have scheduled a trip for 2nd of jan on 7 30 to 7 40. so schedule uber go now i have to click on this for the 2nd of jan at 7 30 to 40. i click on this and it's scheduling our trip so let's look at what we get so upcoming trip uh this is to Forum Sujana Mall on the 2nd of Jan and the estimated fare should be somewhere around 140 to 177 rupees. I can click on done. So that's how things are. And also in case your plans change or something like that, you can at any point of time go ahead and you can cancel it or also edit the date. And you know, like you can always like say you didn't want to have it on the 2nd, you want to have it on the 1st and at 4.30 in the evening say. So you can go ahead and like this is the hour and the minute is already set at 4.30, say 4.35 or maybe 4.30. So I can do it and I can click on update also. So this is how like simple it is to go ahead and book a Uber ride in advance. Now I know people are saying, some of you are actually saying that you don't get to see the uh, hour clock and that's pretty strange because here in India at least we are getting to see it and what further proof can I give it to you that I actually get to see this. You know? So hopefully this should help and if you still are not able to see this you can call up customer care or something maybe or maybe the location where you are uh, there maybe the app is not presenting you with the 
schedule option or something but definitely here where i am in hyderabad this definitely is there so if this helps please go ahead and share this work with your friends colleagues families relatives on social media whatsapp and all those wonderful things it really helps us in making our work reach out to the masses i'm really doing all those basic things so that you know all the people like maybe those who are not uh, as fortunate as us to know about all these digital things they also can get a little bit of help like doing a little bit to touch out to them and reach out to them sorry and maybe yeah, you can do that and help us and also subscribe and click on the bell icon i mean all of this in a good way uh, thank you so much i hope this helps thank you